Hi guys, here with Jazz. We're looking at uh, spirals or tilts from the turtle. Good way of off balancing people and uh, getting back on top of them and in control. Good for MMA, good for striking. So if, we, uh, if we're in a slight front headlock position, I keep my weight down here. Obviously I need to beat this arm, otherwise he's gonna grab my leg as I spin around and put me on my back. So I'm gonna beat this arm here. I'm gonna come all the way around and get to this frog ride position. Pinch my knee, a bit like a jockey. Uh, obviously this is good for hitting here, like a body lock. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and spiral him. Now two ways I can spiral, I can fall off left and right and I'm kind of straightening my arms like this. So if you watch Jazz's hips, I block this arm, block his knees. See it kind of tilts his hips. Okay, so I'm just riding and just tilting the hips. So this is a nice drill to warm up with. We're just falling off. Now I've got two choices here with Jazz. I can pull him on top of me so I can spiral here and pull him on top of me and set my, my hooks this way, get the seat belt, put my hooks in, or I can start kicking them off, coming back on top, get this uh, chicken wing grip, or uh, Kimura grip, step over, you can start attacking the back, start attacking the arms, start attacking the leg. Okay, the other thing I can do, instead of pulling him on top of me, is just uh, uh, pull it, uh, get myself on top of him, so I can spiral here, block, block off, off this side in his post, and just go straight on top. Okay, and then control. If he wants to go to his knees, I want to keep my elbow back, go to your knees that way. And I just control this way and I can just kind of pull him back and keep on top. If he wants to put his back on the floor, I'm keeping my chest here. So I'm driving here, keeping my chest. So it's a good control position. So the, the drill from the frog ride here, instead of setting my hooks, if his knees are quite narrow here, it's just easy to drop off and just plow him over with my hip. So if his knees are wide, you can start, but he's defending against me putting my hooks in, that's why I'm going to use that spiral, okay? I'm going to spiral him here, and just turn him over. Okay, the other thing I like to do is, once I've snapped him down, I spin, I can come to the side and spiral immediately, or I can slingshot myself all the way over to the other side and create that momentum to slingshot him over, okay? So using that right cheese, just. Using that riding position, I find it's great for, for striking for MMA because we can transition, get to the superior position to strike, i.e. from the side or from the back, without committing our hooks and having the ability to stay on top. If I set the hooks and he starts escaping, I end up in, on the bottom using my guard. It could be a dangerous spot if my guard isn't good. Plus he has an advantage of the weight and the gravity, he's going to find it easy to strike. So I find that the riding is a better meta for the MMA and the fact that you're always staying on top. Really important. Hope you enjoy. Thanks a lot.